guys, Seth Erskins here with Sam, Ryan, Logan, Charlie, and Nate Miller, who's filming. We just saw Thor Love and Thunder. Guys, what'd you think? Woo! <laughs> All right, guys, I thought I thought it was a I thought it was an okay film. I mean, I mean, an okay good film. I thought I I I, I thought the visuals were great and the. Uh, the first act was kind of messy and a little too goofy, though, and a little, and a little hard to follow around. And the Guardians were there. I mean, props, props to them showing up. But but they were like, they were like 15 minutes and then they're out. I mean, I just felt I just felt like, well, oh, see you, see you Guardians three, 15 minutes out. See you Thor. Pfft. Yep. But um, overall, overall, when the film picked right up at the second half, when 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 Jane was introduced, Natalie Portman did a great job coming back to her character again, and as Mighty Thor. Yeah, and um, guys, it had Taika Waititi did a good job writing this film. I mean, I I, I had a fun time laughing at this film. Um, it's not my favorite Marvel film of the year for sure, not yet. I mean, it's, it's it's I'm still waiting for that though. But I'm hoping that Black Black Panther: Wakanda Forever at the end of the year will surprise us though, because it has to at this point if Marvel wants to keep keep ahead of the game. But overall. I still think it's a great film. If you, if you love Thor Ragnarok as much as I did, you'll love this film. But I still think the Ragnarok, Ragnarok was better. I'm going to give this a solid 8.5 out of 10. Great good film. All right. Ryan, what do you got? Uh, I agree with Seth. I like when you said it was an okay, good movie. I think that really covers it. Uh, I really did like Christian Bale, a good villain. Uh, pretty complex, a little different, uh, a little darker for a Marvel movie. But I liked it. Uh, I'm also with Seth. The Guardians uh, showed up for two minutes and got their paycheck and headed out. The Guardians 3. Yes. So, but yeah, the beginning was a little weird, but it came into its own in the back half of the movie. So I'll give it a 8.6 out of 10. Ooh, one up me there. Yep. <laughs> All right, pass it to Sam. What do you got, Sam? I think they summed it up very nicely. Uh, I definitely laughed a lot. Uh, it was very funny. It also did some heavy themes really well. Um, it was a good movie. It, it definitely feels like Marvel is kind of like spinning out of control and just kind of all over the place. Uh, it definitely adds to that problem instead of curtailing it. But it was okay. I give it a seven. We can blame it on JPEG. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Logan. What do you think? What do you got, buddy? Uh, good film. Lots of action. Introduced a new character that I'm excited to see how that develops. I'll give it an eight. Awesome. You got Betty? Uh, I liked the movie. I thought it got a little cute at the beginning and spun its wheels a bit, but picked it up uh, eventually. And if you're looking for two hours of entertainment, you will definitely get it. Um, I'm actually going to give this uh, an 8.3. Awesome. So, awesome. yeah. Nate Miller. Nate, what do you got, buddy? I gotta agree with the the crew. It, I think feel like this movie had a big focus on comedy, really going for the laughs. They hit on a lot of them. Um, definitely had some emotion to it. Um, and I'm gonna say what Seth said. Probably not my favorite Marvel movie. Definitely not my least favorite. So I'm gonna give it uh, an 8.25 out of 10. So. Ah, sweet. Well, it's a solid, good entry of Marvel film. Just not the best. But guys. Go see this film. Check it out. It's definitely worth it. Worth it. We're seeing film in the summertime for sure. Um, we'll we'll see you guys in a in a couple months. Though we're taking a month hiatus, a few months hiatus until probably October maybe because we have, I don't know many may, may much films that all come out till then because because the, by then we have Black Adam for DCU and then we have to finish up November and I still got to figure out the rest for the rest of the quarter. But guys, uh, thank you so much for joining us. Please remember like and subscribe and remember guys to feel the love, love and thunder. thunder. See you guys. <laughs> Thank you.